dear students today we are going to discuss about the meiosis what is meiosis meiosis is a process where single cell divides twice to produce four daughter cells and they have half the genetic material as a parental cell these are also known as gametes or sex cells these sex cells are involved in the production of new organism meiosis consists of two stages meiosis 1 and meiosis 2 now we are going to briefly look over the meiosis 1 and meiosis 2 Meiosis one consists of four stages: prophase one, metaphase one, anaphase one, and telophase one. In prophase, the chromosome deconsenses, and th there is one of the most important uh, important component of prophase one is that recombination and crossing over occurs in the prophase one, and the chromosome condenses. In the metaphase, the chromosomes align. In the anaphase, chromosomes move to the opposite pole. In the telophase. the chromosome material with the nuclear envelope redevelops and re decondenses now we are going to visualize this in the next slide in detail now let's visualize the stages of meiosis 1 as meiosis 1 consists of prophase 1 in the prophase 1 you can see that first of all the chromosome condenses after the condensation of chromosome the nuclear envelopes break down and the chromosomes that uh, came intact to each other the chiasmata formation occurs where the exchange of genetic material occur where the combination occur where the crossing over occur at this stage the genetic material is exchanged between the chromosomes after the exchange of genetic material in the next phase these chromosomes are aligned in the center which is known as metaphase 1 which is known as metaphase 1 after the metaphase 1 when the chromosomes are pulled apart by the spindle fibers this is called anaphase 1 after the anaphase 1 in the last stage where the chromosomes have reached its opposite pole the cleavage forms and the two daughter cells are produced but this is not the end of meiosis this is the end of meiosis 1 and after this these two cells will undergo further division now we are going to discuss the stages of meiosis 2 which consists of prophase 2 metaphase 2 anaphase 2 and telophase 2 with this cytokinesis before we can go into discussion about these stages we need to visualize these stages you, you can see that now we have two daughter cells and the both daughter cells will undergo meiosis too in the same way a spindle forms around the chromosomes in the prophase the chromosomes are already condensed the spindle formation occurs after that the chromosomes in the both daughter cells are aligned at the equator which are pulled about by each by the each centriole to the opposite direction you can clearly see that in the initial the chromosomes were in similar in color means one chromosome was completely blue and the other was completely red but now after the exchange of material has occurred you can see that the each chromosome consists of blue or red color this is due to the recombination or crossing over you can see that now the chromosome have moved to the opposite poles in the last stage we can see that which is the telophase 2 which is the telophase 2 and which is a cytokinesis that both daughter cells divide into two cells producing half number of chromosomes why here uh, the uh, chromosomes are not diploid because after the meiosis 1 there is no replication again that's why the chromosome have halved at the end of the daughter cell these are the four chromosomes now we have discussed in detail the stages of meiosis 1 and the meiosis 2 now your task is to identify different stages through the provided permanent slide okay for that you need a microscope and a permanent slide that will be provided by a teacher now i am giving you some examples you need to see what stages they represent what is this stage because there are four daughter cells you can easily conclude that it's the telophase 2 as we have discussed in the slides previously four daughter cells are produced at the telophase stage i am going to the next slide now can you see can you identify this stage it's a simple stage but it is whether it's uh, metaphase 1 or 2 you need to identify and characterize the slide as the chromosomes are aligned in the center it should be a metaphase whether it's metaphase 1 or metaphase 2 if you remember there is breakdown of chromosomes in the meiosis 2 the sister chromosomes are pulled apart but in this case it are not a movement to the opposite parts that's why it's a metaphase 2 in the next stage this is third slide you have to identify these are two cells now two daughter cells as a result of meiosis so from all the discussion we can clearly identify the different stage of meiosis 
from or whether it's belong to meiosis 1 or meiosis 2 you have to keep in mind the mechanism of crossing over and the recombination in order to identify different stage of meiosis even the alignment of sister or non sister chromatids so we have identified the different stage of meiosis through discussion now i hope you can understand and identify different stages of meiosis in the permanent slides thank you